Welcome back. In this rapid game last night, my opponent tried a little trap from the England Gambit on me, and it didn't work because I've seen the same YouTube videos that they've seen. Um, the idea of the England Gambit, I'm not sure, but I know that it's frustrating because it messes up my plan of doing the London system or my plan of doing the Queen's Gambit declined. But you can take this free pawn. In fact, it is the best move. However, um, as soon as my opponent made this move, I realized they are targeting this pawn for a future, and I, I remembered the trap video. I developed normally. When they move this pawn, you can take that too, although it's probably not your best move. Develop normally. But I took it, knowing that they were about to do this, which they did. Notice that no seconds elapsed on their clock between their last two moves. The idea is to make this look like a mistake, that you can take it. But if you do, they will take this bishop with check. You can't escape over here because of their queen, so you have to take that bishop, and then they get your queen for free. So. When that knight moves out, that looks like a mistake, just ignore it. And what I did was move this pawn up to block the bishop. So now, if they don't take my pawn, or if they don't move this knight, I can take it. But that's the idea. Is it's made to look like a mouse slip? Don't take it. Continue your normal plan. This pawn has already taken two pawns. It's done its job. It can die now. That's what pawns are for. So. What I did was move this pawn up, they took the pawn, and we went about playing chess. But now I have a huge advantage because I have cleared out both of black central pawns. And I have two pieces developed just like them, but I still have a central pawn. Uh, both of us are prepared to castle, which we both did, and the game went on as usual. In this case, my opponent, I think, at some point realized that they were lagging and uh, had the disadvantage, so they just began spamming the chat with <laughs> Uh, messages intended to distract me but I went ahead and won it by ignoring the chat and uh, but hopefully if you see that same trick here you can avoid it too now again taking the second pawn isn't the best move according you can see Stockfish's recommendations here uh, it recommends to develop this knight to c3 or advance the a pawn or even just uh, get this bishop out to here which guards this pawn and uh but what i did uh was taking the pawn is fine they can take back here um, or get their knight out but if they do that just ignore it and go on about your business so hopefully that helps thank you for watching